Hey, what's up guys? It's Pedro here from NoobCoder.com and in this tutorial we're going to talk about the cons keyword in JavaScript. Now similar to the let keyword I talked about in the previous tutorial, the cons keyword allows us to declare variables, gets rid of hoisting, and gives us block scoping. The difference is that the cons keyword is used to declare constants. So I could say something like const x, assign it the value of 5, and in the next line, if I try to reassign this variable, I will get an error. So if I just save this and run this in the browser, you see that we get a type error, assignment to constant variable. And it even tells you the line that uh, the error occurred, and it occurs at line 12. So we declared the x uh, variable to 5. We try to change x to 6, and it doesn't like that. And the reason being is because this is a constant. Now, let's take a look at what would happen if I didn't initialize the value of x to 5. So let me just get rid of all that. And let me just declare x like a normal variable. So now I'm going to save it. Head over to Chrome. Hit refresh again. And you can see if I go to console, hey, missing initializer in cons declaration. So all that means is, hey, if you declare a constant variable, you do have to give it a value. You can't let it uh, be assigned nothing. Now, a common gotcha with uh, working with the cons keyword is when we start working with objects. So I'm just going to assign this x an array, one, two, three, four. Now, arrays in JavaScript are objects. So it's important to note that the object does not have to be immutable. So that means that I can add values into that object. So for example, if I say x dot push, and I was to push five onto the array and save it, head over to Chrome, hit refresh. Well, you see that we get no errors. Now I really should have printed that out and let's actually print out x. Let's save it again, hit refresh. And you can see that we get our array with five elements. Now, why is this? That's because we're not changing what X is referencing. X is referencing this array object in memory. We haven't changed it. We added a value to it. But let's say if I was to try to reassign it, and let's say a new array with just one and two. I'm gonna save it, head over to Chrome, hit refresh, and you can see now we're getting problems, assignment to a constant variable. So all this means is I can add stuff to objects like we did for our array. I could push stuff onto it, no problem. But I can't change it to reference another object. And that's really the only uh, got you there is to using the const keyword in JavaScript ES6.